So it's the 67th minute. We finally got ourselves back in the game. It's one all. And then tell me what happened. Um, yeah, I think after that, we just um, had a flood of confidence, really. Um, we went for it. We knew that we had to, to go all out. And um, yeah, we managed to, to keep going to the end and, and managed to get four. And so when the ball breaks to you in the box, it's not an easy chance. The angle's probably against you. What's running through your mind? What are you planning to do? And what, what did you manage to do? Um, I was just assessing the situation, really. I think um, Wolves probably helped me with his run. Um, took the centre back away and it, it freed up the space for me and I managed to get, get a clean shot off and, yeah, managed to trickle over the line. And people always talk about, you know, you'd happily see it going up your backside. In that case, it trickled over the line. What, what was, that must have felt like a long time. <laughs> yeah, um, I think sometimes I've, I've been a bit unlucky at times and when it was just going over the line, I was thinking, is someone going to clear it or, or whatever, but it managed to go in and, um, yeah, after that we managed to get a few more. And David Brooks grabs you for the celebration. You can see how much it meant, not just to yourself, but to the other 10 players in the field with you. Yeah, definitely. Um, in times like this, we need to stick together. And um, uh, in the last few weeks, we haven't quite managed to, to get the results we, we needed. But today, um, we, all, we all did well as a team. And yeah, I think it showed in the celebrations how much it meant to us. And it also seemed to carry on because, again, you had a not a particularly easy chance towards the end of the game. And you took that with a plum. How much did the first goal make that second goal a thing? Yeah, I think um, in football, especially when you get one goal in the game, you, you look to, to go on and get another one. And, um, yeah, you can get some confidence from the first one and yeah, that helped you for the second. And tell me how you're feeling now as opposed to how you felt two, maybe two hours ago. Uh, yeah, a lot better. Um, obviously, the, the win was the most important thing. Um, watching all the other teams around us win um, over the weekend, we knew we had to win today and um, yeah, we managed to get that. And Joshua King, of course, missed out today. That gave you opportunity. You've had a, a few opportunities. What was it? How did you make sure you, you managed to take this one? And I'm sure you're putting yourself right in the, in the manager's mind for the next game. Yeah, as I said, we just knew that we had to win. And um, obviously, um, starting the game today, I knew that I had to, to try and just give everything I could and um, try to help the team to, to win. And I managed to do that. And how important could this be as a catalyst? We know there's only three games left, but there's thankfully three more points on the board for us now. How important will that be? Yes, yeah, massive. Um, we need every point we can get at the moment, and um, we know that we've got only got three games left, so we need to go and attack those games and get as many points as we can. And of course, you took that big chance you had today. Manchester City coming up in midweek. If we get any chances there, we're going to have to take them, aren't we? Yeah, of course. Everyone knows um, all over the world how, how good of a team Man City are, and um, yeah, as I said, we need every point we can get, so we're going to have to go there and, and fight. Congratulations. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers, mate. Thank you. Cheers.